Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and today in this video, I'm gonna show, how to enable eMMC and MMC cards on Mac OS. So before starting, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, then please go and subscribe to our channel and stay connected for the latest updates. So without a further ado, let's get started. Currently, I'm booting to the Mac OS installer using Internet Recovery, to show you that by default the eMMC or MMC would not be detected by Mac OS. After booting to the installer, here in the disk utility, you can see, that only the external USB is being detected. And there is no internal media as detected. To fix this, you'll need OpenCore Auxiliary Tool, or any equivalent tool for editing config plist, Emerald SDHC Kext, and of course your EFI. Now, place the Emerald SDHC Kext in your EFI's Kext folder. Also, make sure that your Kexts are already up to date, and Lilu is of the latest version. After placing the text, open config plist. Now in the kernel section, add the entry for the text, and move it in proper order. After arranging the entry, save the config plist and then boot using the created EFI. And now as you can see, internal devices are being detected. Here internal media is a secure digital internal physical disk, in short, eMMC. On which Mac OS Sonoma is already installed. Here the connection type also shows secure digital, and the device path tree shows PEMC. Now let me show you more info on this after booting to Mac OS with the same internal SD drive.
After booting to Mac OS, let me show you that the SD drive is the same, and we'll verify that it's eMMC in my case using the IO reg. Here in Hackentool, under the disks, you can see, that the device name is the same as shown earlier. Under PCIe section, you can also see that the IO reg name is PEMC. Now, let me show you more precisely using IO reg. Here in IO reg, upon scrolling a bit down, you can see the PEMC, which is being loaded and working using Emerald SDHC text, and the SD media is also being displayed. So that was it, EMMC is enabled, and Mac OS is installed on it, and working as expected. So that was it, hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, and subscribe to the channel. And if you have any questions, just comment down below, or create a thread on our forum. Make sure to check out the forum for in-depth guides. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.